Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about this three-sided guitar pick right here. So let's do it. Hey guys, real quick, before we get started, just wanted to let you know that down in the description you can find out more information about this guitar pick, some links to the website, and maybe the gear that I use. So a little bit of backstory about this pick right here. I was on Upwork one day. I was just looking around for some free, freelance music work. And I found this guy looking for somebody to review a guitar pick for $10. It was a 3D print of this model before it came out. So I did a review of this and I actually posted it on my YouTube channel. And then uh, his name is Paul. He messaged me and said, hey, can you take this off your YouTube channel? Uh, the pick is not out yet. Um, and so wait till the full version comes out and then we'll send you another and you can do another review. So uh, that's just a brief bit of story. So I actually got $10 to review a guitar pick. I mean, it's kind of cool. So the first thing to say about this pick is I love the design. Uh, I love the little logos on the picks. I love uh, the idea, how it's made. It's a really cool idea. So for anything else, this is just one of those things that's cool to have sitting around your house when somebody who plays guitar walks in and says, hey, what's that? That looks cool. Uh, they pick it up and they want to play with it. So, I mean, that's a really cool thing, just that it has uh, a different kind of quality about it that makes people want to pick it up and see what it is. Also, people have been throwing them at each other like ninja stars, which is kind of funny. So there is this hole in the center, and the hole in the center adds just a little bit of control. Uh, that way the pick stays in your hand a little more and also in the design itself you can see it's kind of uh, It's got three raised areas in between each of the different pick sides uh, That kind of along with the hole keep the pick in your hand being that it is a guitar pick automatically Makes it more likely to get lost so it's a good thing that uh, the guys at Bog Street sent me four of these the material here is nylon um, some people like that, some people don't. Uh, I haven't had any issues with that. The material is great. The one thing that I do have issue with is I have a guitar grip that is like Paul Gilbert's. And whenever I pick this up and try to hold it like that, uh, the pick rubs against my finger a little bit and causes just a little bit of awkwardness whenever I play. So I have to adjust my grip just a little bit in order to play. But other than that, this pick has been wonderful. So, being that this is a guitar video about a guitar pick, I'm gonna play a little bit for you guys, so let's get into it. Alright, thank you so much for watching this video guys. Uh, go check out Box Street. Great guy, great fellow, great pick. Uh, I encourage you maybe to buy one just to have one laying around your house. Uh, thanks again for watching and I'll catch you next time.